Hey guys, it's Mad Chen here. I created another delete a background in Procreate tutorial. Since Procreate had updated their software, some of you may be experiencing problems with the tools that I had shown in the first delete a background tutorial. As promised, I'll keep you guys up to date to ensure that the tools are working for you. So stick around and we'll get into the updated method in a few moments. Welcome back fellow artists and if you're new to my channel, welcome! I'm Mad Chen and I'm a digital illustrator. I create Procreate tutorials for beginners. Welcome back guys! So let's get started. So first, let's go to layers and we'll toggle off the background color layer. Next, let's make a duplicate of the image. Then we'll toggle off the second layer under. It's always good practice to have a duplicate copy available in case you make any mistakes. For now, we'll work on the top layer. Next, click on the Selections tool and go to the menu down here. Make sure you have Freehand selected as well as Add here on the left. Now I'm going to zoom into my image and pick a point where I want to start. I'll start down here on the wrist and basically what I'm going to do is outline the image that I want to keep. So I'll go all the way around until I get back to the point where I started. If you make any mistakes, just tap the screen with two fingers to undo and then keep tracing around the image. I'll just quickly finish selecting the rest of the image before I show you the updated method on how to use this tool. Now that we're almost back where we started, I'll just go a little bit outside the canvas before I finish the selection. Now the next part is quite important because there's a trick with the selection tool. There are two ways to finish the selection. The first is not to close the loop, as you can see on my screen, where the end and start points are not touching. And the second is to click on the white dot here which will turn your image black or white. If you chose the second option, you need to use two fingers to tap on the screen to undo so that the image you selected comes back on the canvas. Once you've done either one of these methods, you need to click on layers to have some diagonal lines show up at the back of your selected image. So in layers, click on the image here on the left, a menu will pop up and choose mask from the list. Then all you need to do is pinch the mask layer and your main image together. Thanks for watching guys! Now you know how to delete a background in Procreate. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. You can also leave comments to let me know if the tool is working for you. Until next time, take care of yourselves and I'll see you in the next video.